Okay, today is April 25th, and I have started um, my Summer Rain Project, which is my next play. And <clears throat> yesterday, did the music for... Oh, Lord, my face looks fat. Anyway, did the music for um, Summer Rain with my sister friend, Carrie Vaughn, and... It was just, you know, this is my, I've been writing for years now, but, um, <clears throat> you know, it's hard when you want to go to sell things and you're using other people's music. And, um, you know, I, I grew up playing the organ in my father's church, you know, since I was, you know, 10 years old. So, you know, I had the musical um, experience as far as knowing how to play, but, um, <clears throat> Um, I just figured I would just try my hand at the music. Um, so, I got my little cell phone right here. And my husband is a musician and a producer. And so, he was like, okay, hon. I have been asking him, babe, just do me some music. You know, just let me have some music. So, he finally did a CD for me. Um... And so I just start listening to the music over and over and to start getting, getting the lyrics and the melodies. And so I start singing um, <clears throat> into my phone. Now, I'm not a singer at all, <clears throat> but I want you to just hear how it starts, you know. So the first song I wrote was Good Day. And so, you know, it starts like this. And so I'll, I'll let you hear good day. This is how it starts. This is in the raw. This is me without my little jawbone. It's gonna be a good day. Sound like a little kid, huh? It's gonna be a good day. This coffee mug here is to cover up my no-nails. Okay, so that's the song, and that's how it started out, right? You know, you hear how I sound like a little kid, but, you know, the lyrics and the melodies are coming to me. So, you know, if when you start writing and you, you know, do your thing, God, I, I understood yesterday what they meant by, you know, God will just take what you have and make it more than you imagine. So... Got in the studio yesterday with my friend Carrie Vaughn. We listened to the music, you know, going over the melodies and, you know, showing her how I liked it and, you know, how the melody went. So then this is what she recorded yesterday. And this is going to be, I got three songs, you know, um, for the play before I'm even really starting to write the play. So I wanted to record them because I want to use them as inspiration and uh, for me when I'm writing atmosphere is just very very important and so just playing those songs while I'm writing and just you know having God come in and establish my thoughts and you know writing um, the play so I want you to hear my friend Miss Carrie Vaughn and all I had to say in the studio was oh my Jesus because she is just so um, talented and so talented and, and humble and just, you know, really gifted. Okay, here's Carrie. It's gonna be a good day. 
song, Good Day, and in the studio, you know, once you write it, and, and I hear her singing it, and to actually have her in the studio, you know, and, and, and like for me, that does it for me. Like, as a writer, you know, like you, you know, when you're writing, I can see it, I can envision it, and I like to like get in a cozy little spot, because again, atmosphere is everything to me. And so, to actually, um, that's my phone by the way, actually see it come to life and, you know, yesterday just to see her in her ele element like as an anointed singer and, you know, doing what she does, like that was just so, you know, exhilarating to me to, to do the work and then, you know, see the artists in, in, in their vein and doing their thing and how it just all just magically you know works together it just you know really does it for me so um i came in this room today this is my dining room and you know my whole inspiration for you know finally you know using my gifts in my parents church and all of that and, and you know after honing you know born and raised in it doing everything in the church, you know, I, I did all the plays, this and that, and it's like, you know, you have these years of experience, you know, when you start doing stuff, people think that um, you just started, but really, you've been doing it since you were a child, and, you know, no, I really didn't just start, I've been doing this for years, honing and, you know, shaping, and my skills have been shaped and molded, and so, um, I didn't just start, you know. So, when my Aunt Olivia died and my grandma died, and, you know, in particular, my Aunt Olivia, because my grandmother was, you know, um, in her uh, 80s, mid-80s when she passed, so she lived her life, so that was, that death was a little bit easier to accept, but my Aunt Olivia, you know, she just really inspired me because she was just so incredibly talented, talented songwriter. You know, she just lived life. Her her personality was larger than life. And, you know, I feel like I'm a lot like her in a lot of ways. Um, and so she just inspired me, you know, being at her funeral and hearing people talk about her. And, you know, <clears throat> I just wanted to you know, honor her when I started my business and named it after her. So today, you know, I'm coming in here listening to the music, Carrie. I'm sitting here in my little old faithful notebook, you know, writing down words and getting ideas. But I just kind of wanted to be close to her. And, you know, she has sat at this very dining room table. And hopefully I'm in one of the chairs that, you know, she used to sit in and talk and eat and have crazy, be crazy and, you know, I just kind of wanted to feel close to her. And so I really have a thing about, you know, atmosphere, but I really feel like she's around me. I'm going to show you something crazy. Like when I've been writing lately, I've been going outside and every time I go out there to write or to do something with, you know, write a song or something, this bird comes. So today... The bird came. I'm sitting down. I said, hmm, "Let me. I'm gonna get up and move to the table." So I got up and moved. So the bird got up and moved too, and went to the palm tree. I don't know if you can see this. Let's see if I can make it big. I took a picture of it. Let me see if you can see it right there. And the whole time I was out there playing my music and doing my thing, this this bird just sat in a palm tree in my backyard and listened. I felt like a, a connection to it in a way. I don't know if that was, you know, my Aunt Libby or, you know, but, you know, I, I just really um missing her today and came in here because I wanted to be close to her. So I've decided to make now, you know, just in the studio with Carrie yesterday and she's like, Nicole, you know, I just, I want to move like when we're doing these songs. And so, I really think I'm going to make this play a Broadway musical piece. So, I'm just in here today in my dining room writing. So, 
listening to the song and being inspired. Here we go.